Okay. Go ahead. Thank you. Um, so in his statement on the anniversary of October 7 today, Secretary Blinken specifically mentioned uh, the names of Americans killed by Hamas, but he did not mention Americans who were killed by Israel since October 7, like Tevfik Ajag, Aisha or Ezgi Egi. Why were these Americans not mentioned in the statement? And is that, you know, does that indicate no. a different no. standard for Americans uh, based on who killed uh, them? Uh, ab absolutely not. And if you've seen this, uh, our public statements, we have spoken out forcefully, forcibly about American citizens who have been killed today, or have been killed on both sides of this conflict. The statement the secretary put out today, though, was about the anniversary of October 7th. But it, and, the, it hold also, on, and hold on, and the people that died in the attacks on October 7th, and the American citizens who were taken hostage on the deaths on, the, on October 7th. You have seen us on other occasions speak out, and we will continue to speak out force, forcefully about other American citizens who die anywhere across the world. But the statement today was about October 7th, and in no way is a statement about the anniversary of October 7th going to cover the entire sweep of this conflict. But we thought it was important to, on this anniversary of the horrific attacks, to <coughs> memorialize the people who were killed as part of those attacks. And, and do you have any update on the investigation into the killing of Aishinur? Uh, it, it continues to be underway. I don't have an, uh, uh, any further update.